welcome back to Press Sex for Chromosomes, where we we looked at the map and Ooh, we saw yeah, we that did. we didn't want to actually go down that way. We wanted to go we up come this, this way. way. Oh, she has shit to say. Your Majesty, are you well? Yes. <coughs> yes, it just sucks here. A wine more, Meve. <laughs> I know, right? You went through Adern, where it was like burning everyone alive and that kind of stuff. You're like, this is but fine. But this is different? I'm sure Maybe it just smells like farts versus like the bog ash of the, and death. The bog yeah. of eternal stench. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, sulfuric acid. Yeah. Just like, why does it smell like rotten eggs? Jesus. Oh. Battle. I was trying to grab the thing first just because I could. It came fight, around the backside. Fight. 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 Ooh, oh, yeah. is this the, the... Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. Is that the thing that uh, we had to the, throw like, the baby into the furnace It for? looks like it. They're like, her, yeah. Herm or him. Yeah, him, it says yeah. him. Yeah. Have you ever heard of the monsters known to Skelegas as him? No? It's a powerful demon that feeds on the souls of those who have committed a terrible evil. But who in Meme's unit could have attracted such a vile creature? Who of the Queen's companions was responsible for an act heinous enough to garner the demon's attention? Eliminate the him without any allies being killed. Puzzle, special, shortened, custom. I think that is supposed to be fucking uh, Lug or whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what you get for killing your brother. Yeah, right. Okay, so we got a scytheman and we've got a priest. Okay, and the hymn. Every turn on turn start, play a copy of the last card the opponent played. This unit will always target Meave's leftmost unit. Okay, and I don't have Meave here, so right. I, he's not going to gain anything ever. Um, give, give one, one charge. charge a decent. Units with order. With order, but that's deploy, and he's already deployed. Right. So Damage the highest unit on the battlefield by up to 15. Then boost the lowest by amount damaged. Okay, and then this is damage by 10 and adjacent by 5. five. Okay. The lowest by the power of the highest alley. Ally, okay. Yeah. Not. Huh. Okay. And then damage yeah, the same by one, eight yeah. times. So I'm guessing the dark mirror might First. be handiest. Yeah. It's gonna boost him, and then the him is going to Play target a copy. the the copy, but and he will also only ever target the left. So he's gonna have a twenty. Huh. Well, let's let's try it. Yeah. See what. Oh. Okay. So. Now we need to do the co no 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 no. Boost the lowest by the power of the highest. The electricity. But that would damage. No, no, yeah, no, I think it is literally the cup. Because everything else would have killed that guy. Because he's only going to target this guy, and I'm supposed to let right. them die. I think that's the only option, honestly. I just did nothing for him mm -hmm. but now i can do something like this or this okay yeah and i can actually like take it well i don't know if the mirror will help at all at this point because it's damaging the highest unit by 15 and then boosting the lowest so yeah. i don't think it would help at all so let's try the fun or the rinse done no what i think what we might need to do is actually just we might need to use this against us to use the mirror again. Okay. I think this is what this is for. Okay. Right, because yeah, now he's the highest again. Yeah, and he I'm not sure if he'll use the same. Yeah. That's fine. But that's fine, yeah, because yeah. now we can use the mirror. And theoretically, he should be under eight points. But then this would kill my... Oh, no, because it's going to boost me. Right. Yeah, exactly. And then, and then now... we can use the ru the rune stone to kill the rest. After this, but he gets healed by it because oh, he's healed. the lowest. Yeah. Maybe we need to use the rune stone first. Okay. I think right. Just... Okay. Okay. Yeah. So that way it just lowers him. Yeah. Because it damages but... up to fifteen. Yeah. Okay. So it was mirror, mirror, Merlot, lightning, rune stone, mirror. Yes. Potentially. I 
Should we use runestone first? Yeah, let's do runestone first, because I'm a little nervous about that damage by 10. Yeah, same. We could hit the guy. Hit the priest. The priest. Because yeah. then he'll stay above 20. Yeah. Or he'll stay above 10. Yeah. And that's exactly what we need. So we should have this. There we go. Nice. There we go. I think the up to 15 confuses me because I'm like, but what if it doesn't do the full damage? Yeah, I don't know the time when ooh. it would like... Do less than fifteen. Yeah. Other than the it wasn't fact clear that, about that, other than the fact that it's like, okay, well, if it doesn't have fifteen power, then Maybe it's that's what do. it meant. Yeah. Yeah. Here, let's look at our card first. Yeah. Before we check out this tent. Before I, before you get your camera ready. Oh, I'll get my camera ready. I'm getting it ready right now. I am getting it ready right Watch now. Out. There it is. Uh, sponsored Spon copies of a Death Wish unit on the battlefield to destroy, destroy them. them. Oh the my fucking... gosh, that could be great with the Onogger. I don't know. A little, I'm like or a little bit like, but it's a trinket, and we use all of our trinkets kind of regularly now. So somewhat regularly, this would be a good strat at some point, though. Right. Also think about for fucking God, because um, that would be one hell of a thing for and Isabel, yeah. Isabel, yeah. Like if you just make a deck that's just meant to like with sacrifice the, people with the fucking like foot soldiers, yeah, and the Wagenberg, and since the, they have a death wish, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's oh. see here, Milady. We've searched the enemy's camp. The tents are spattered in blood, and shields lie scattered on the grass. But there's no sign of the bodies. We also found a map tucked inside one of the chests. It appears the Elf Guardians buried the regimental. Regimental safe as if they expected danger and knew not whether they'd return. Show me the map. The map, the map, the map. I don't think we've come across that yet. Maybe not yet, but we've... Maybe? Soon. We'll see. And I don't think I went all the way up. We have not. Hey, let me in. Knock, knock. In Angren, all decomposes. Be it dead or very much alive. Rot blights trees, seeping sores torment beasts, and the whole swamp emits the acrid, stifling stench of decay. So when, in the swamp's distant corner, the Lyrians caught whiffs of smoke and roasted meat, they stopped dead in their tracks. The scouts followed their noses to a clearing framed by a palisade. Wherever they go. In the gaps <laughs> process, they spotted a small fort. Any banners upon it? Whose do you see? Asked the queen. There aren't none, your grace. Not one golden sun, not one silver lily. Knock. Uh, yeah. The gate Hello. Knock, knock, knock. Moments later, a dozen armed men appeared atop the rampart. The one who led them wore a beard. Who are you? Why are you here? I'm Meave, Queen of Lyria and Rivia. At war with Nilfgaard, I ventured into these swamps. Is there a war on? <laughs> hey, that's news. Certainly, but little concern to me. The name's Gimpy Gerwin, and I rule these lands. Is that so? As conferred upon you by whom? By me. <laughs> Angren's a good I bit guess, fair enough. than folk think. And no duke's or emperor's finger stand to reach its every corner. Thus, I just up and took this particular nook made it mine so let's parley me one ruler to another at the risk of being blunt i don't care who wins this war but i want to be in good standing with whoever does so i <laughs> offer you a fire at which to warm your limbs also a place at my table and beds for you to rest on condition you pledge to me one very small thing to respect the sacred laws of hospitality. Well, 
she's sure, going for hospitality yeah. yeah i don't know what hospitality means but hospitality means no no, no, no. I, I know oh, okay, what okay. i know what hospitality means i don't know what it means in this context that's like fair. that's a that's a subjective thing i mean i guess i'm guessing there's like some sort of like overarching law of hospitality yeah. in witcher and that's probably mm. what he means but again, not that i've read people make up shit all the time in that's witcher fair. so i'm like fuck it i think it's just but sure why not I do solemnly swear before the gods and my ancestors that we shall honor all the lords of hospitality. I won't do pagan gods, but whatever you want, sure. <laughs> yeah. Welcome inside. The fort was simple. I think I didn't do his shit. Covered with thatch. I think I was like, nah. Inside. But maybe I did. I don't know. I don't remember. Dry. When I get one of those scenes where it's the actual characters, mm -hmm. I assume it might be better than any. Like it might actually be something. Right. Faces, and Meave's spirits were lifted so I'm more, more inclined to take like chances mm -hmm. and eagerly shared both food and tale. He'd led a mercenary band, and they'd stumbled into Angren, discovered a land unclaimed by any feudal lord. He directed the fort, then united the surrounding villages under his very own rule. The folk here are savage, defiant, he said, sipping wine. I keep them on a well, have you seen where they live? They kind of have to be. I know. They'd slit your throat first chance they got. Late that night, me went to see if her mare had been dressed. In the stable, she happened on a farmhand. Recognizing the queen, the man fell to his knees and averted his eyes. Mead noticed a strange object dangling from a rope around his neck. A human hand half rotted to the bone. What? What is that? My wife's hand, your grace, stammered the peasant. Lord Gerwin caught a sneak in some grub. Scraps, really. Took her and told me to wear it so I'd remember what happens when... When... Meave left the stable without uttering another word. She went straight to the servants' barracks. In the pale glow of her torch, she looked over the peasants, all terrified, all with fresh, bleeding wounds. The queen felt rage rise inside her. Well, we did oath. <laughs> as much as it fucking sucks. <laughs> Should we leave? Should we not leave? I don't like it, but I don't know how much, like... Because, again, this is The Witcher. There is fucking, like consequences if you pledge something and then don't follow through i think i think i fucking freed them and then i think i fought him or something oh, okay. like that but i don't exactly remember i don't remember it like or maybe he did just leave because i they, sometimes i'm just like i think at this point i was just like yeah, okay whatever because it's like wh where are they gonna go what are they gonna do yeah i don't know man this this whole this whole map it just sucks. Well, I mean, yeah, that's fair. It's so we we can just leave. Fucking swamp. Not worry. Our dudes are happy for now. They're gonna like know what we magically whatever yeah. they'll pray somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll just we'll walk away. Sorry, sucks. Taken an oath, so her hand paused on the hilt. Gerwin was cruel, deserved to be punished, but Meave would not do the deed. The queen blew her horn woke her men from sweet slumber. She ordered them to assemble. They would march out at once. Gerwin rushed out, confused, to ask what had happened. Meave gave no answer, save to spit at his boots. No, your grace! Ache of Donnell shouted. This is not right! I'll not leave these I guess I'm restarting. Ache drew his sword, and with one mighty strike ran two of Gerwin's soldiers through. The others needed no orders, and fearing for their lives, promptly left at their Lyrian guests. I guess I'm fighting anyway. Oh, should we... Should we just restart? Should we double check if he leaves? I don't... No, I didn't, I didn't read anything about him leaving. Right, because you, you... I don't know. We, we can try it, and then if the text seems weird... Yeah, We can just, right. like, Oop. stop and finish it before we... Yeah, come through because let's do that. Because the thing is, I'm not seeing much of anything, and I'm just unsure because right. I don't know. We're still fighting it. Maybe he'll be cool because we we're trying to honor our oath, right? And he took an oath, right? He should understand that. Should 
theoretically. Well, we still fought with him. Yeah. Okie dokie. See, I didn't have Ike with me, so I didn't know this Yikes. happened. Yeah. yeah. Get out of here. Stop giving me fucking... G oh my god. Is this a shortened battle? Yes. Okay. Why not have... Never mind. I'll get out of here, niggers. Okay. I didn't try to. Oh my god. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh my god. I, okay. I got I got brought into this. Oh Ike's not even on the field. Thank hey, god. Thank goodness. Okay. Well, both good. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, Isabel, how much damage did you fucking field? Uh, how about sit here? Nice. Destroy a locked enemy unit or lock an enemy. Interesting. Split four damages between all enemies. And he had two of those. Yeah. Burst goons, archers by four in hand, deck, and on the battlefield and give Gerwin, Gimpy Gerwin one charge. Hmm. Why does it say in turn? I haven't played a card yet. Did I? Did I play a card already? I don't think you did. Not that I think it would help much, but... It would be something. Yeah. At least we killed one thing. Yeah. Did you play a card? Oh, he did. The, the pitfall trap. Oh. <laughs> Fucking dumb. I know. I completely forgot. I was like, well, I didn't play a card yet. <laughs> Alright. So I was thinking about bringing out fire. Yeah. Bomber's good. And then oh, Raynard, so of course. And I'll bring out more fire. And then Ike. And Ike. Yeah. Discipline Don't want to set you there, but here we are. You mad? Don't say that. We're not fighting monsters, so he's probably not gonna attack. Yeah. Yeah. But I still can play a card. I definitely, still feel like this is his fight in a way. <laughs> yeah, he's the one that started it. <laughs> All right, let's get some. Oh, I could pick her back up and set her down again. Ooh, fuck yeah! Or I could do that with Raynard. That might be better, because yeah. then she gets two charges that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good point. And it could pull out some arbalists and more fucking cavalry dudes. Yeah. Also, should put that out soon. Ugh! Look at Ike. And Isbel too. Yeah. Right Just destroyed my Angier. We should never turn a blind eye to others suffering. Thanks, Isbel. I did it. I did it. Fucking. What happened to my. Oh, he stole my. He stole our fucking cup! I was gonna put that out. That's annoying. <laughs> we. That literally was the car that we were gonna grab, though. I was on it. My cup. How else will I get drunk now? Yeah, right. At least my fire's doing the heavy lifting. Yeah. Every time you lock a dude, I get stronger. I was gonna... Oh, pick Pull up, up Raynard. Raynard. Right. Sir, you are mean. Jesus, these guys have a lot of hits. Yeah, but they're like little tinks. They don't actually hurt us much. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna pull out some arbalists. Like an arbalist and a 
A cavalry dude, maybe? Cavalry, I think, would be handy. See, this I can just fucking go. Yeah. And then I can. I could just end it with another arbalist brain. It's only, it is only optional, optional to defeat fair. him. I'll get a cavalry set on him. Another one. Yeah. Basically, you almost guarantee his death at this point. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna set that Rainer down, right? There we go. He's dead. Shoot him! Murder! Alright, separate? Yeah! Oh! I thought it said optional. Uh, whatever. Or maybe it's optional in the fact that you don't have to kill him. Don't be pissed at us, Ike. I know. Yet still proved no match for me. She knocked his axe from his hand. He fell to his knees. Then she cleaved his head clear off. Rolled like a gourd and came to rest at the peasant's feet. You've your freedom back, growled me, but she wiped her sword. Yet do not take it for granted. Nilfgaard is in Angren. The black clads will come here too. As long as the golden sun flies over the marsh, you must hide in the woods. Neve's force left the fort before dawn. She rode at the fort, lips pursed, jaw clenched. A stain on her honor. She'd broken her word. Apart from all else, it stung on I the inside. Didn't. Dimitrium's shackles. Oh snap! I didn't. I didn't break my word. I broke my word for me. Well, okay, he doesn't seem mad about it. He just was like, "Fuck that! We fucking fight." Right. And uh, Isabel was also just like, "Oh, she thank like, goodness! Yeah, we did good things." And I'm like, it's like, "I feel like we have like Morgan and Alistair again." I know. Well, and, and I'm I'm over <laughs> here being like, "Look, you did the thing that I ultimately wanted to do, right?" But also, I stayed, I stayed true to Meve's word, and then <laughs> Ike did his thing. So like, ultimately, I did nothing wrong, right? And oh, yeah, I got everything I wanted. Summon three bonds units from the opponent's deck to your side and lock them. <laughs> That's kind of mean. I kind of like that. That is very mean. But also, I like our things. But also, I don't use this that much. But I do like it because I can pick and choose. It's just handy to yeah. have in those certain instances. And this is nice because it just fucking does Damages, everything. Yeah. yeah. But if you do want to play around with the shackles, I would suggest maybe popping out the runestone or the horn. I'm thinking about the... I don't know. I, I think these you, are the two I use the least. Yeah, but I think you, you definitely use the runestone sooner the horn. than the horn. Yeah. yeah. Let's try this. Yeah, because that is pretty nasty. Was it random or can you choose? I don't know. We'll find out. Okay, fair <laughs> enough. Reports. Gerwin's code. Listen up, you filthy maggots. Uh, listen up, bumpkins. All transgressions shall be punished with the utmost severity. Theft, off with your arm. Insolence, off with your tongue. Laziness or carelessness, 50 lashes. Trying to escape death. Every time I open up my camera, you know, it shows you like the last picture in your gallery. Yeah. And the last picture in my gallery is a picture of melon soda. Yeah, melon soda. I fucking love melon soda, man. We're free. It is the truth. Yeah, fucking just like super fortify this place. Yeah. I can't see it. I can't move up any further. Yeah. Ooh. I was like, I can't tell what you're saying, but I'm assuming it's different stuff, so you might join me. That's why I was like trying to listen, just be like, is this different? Is this different? Is this different? All I could see was behind enemy lines. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, worth going back this way. Yeah. Yeah. So, look somewhere else and start grinding my face on something. And I think, honestly, this is a good place to stop. Yeah. <laughs> Again, right back where, where we back where we started. <laughs> So we'll catch you guys on the next episode when maybe we go down and see yeah. what is at that Nilf Guardian encampment. <laughs> maybe, but we'll no see. promises. Yeah. We might find another little path to go Ooh. on. So until next time. Bye. bye.